A 36-year-old woman is recovering tonight in Queens Hospital after being mauled by a dog at the Kaneohe Bay sandbar. KITV4's Dick Algaier reports witnesses say the attack was unprovoked and vicious. The tour yacht Dreamer came in from the sandbar at Kaneohe Bay this afternoon, carrying a typical load of Japanese visitors. The employees of the vessel were still stunned by what happened on the tour yesterday. The captain that was on board yesterday is quite traumatized by the event. The operations director says an employee, a 36-year-old Japanese woman, was setting an anchor in the sand yesterday when two unrestrained dogs from another boat ran up and one attacked her. One of them was a 130-pound bull massive and just jumped up and attacked the crew member and uh, knocked her down, then got her by the neck and uh, gave her some serious lacerations behind her ear, her neck and her head. She had surgery last night. She's recovering today. She'll be in hospital for two or three days. Officials with the Department of Land and Natural Resources say the dog was turned over to its owner who could face dangerous dog charges. DLNR officials say it is not clear if dogs are permitted on the sandbar or whether they would need to be leashed. The DLNR is investigating. Obviously, after yesterday's event, it's potentially dangerous. Yeah. Okay. Somebody should look into it for sure. DLNR officials will be meeting tomorrow to talk about alcohol problems at the sandbar. Now they may also need to discuss the issue of unattended and dangerous dogs running loose out there. Reporting from Hayea of Pier, Dick Allgaier, KITV4 News. Well, tour company employees say the woman is a Japanese national here on a visa to work for the tour boat. She is expected to recover, but the injuries were serious.